Manga collecting can be one of the most rewarding and great things you can do with your time and your money. Reading and getting into these wonderful worlds, all of this manga has a cost. There is a cost to collecting and it is money. Time and resources can be wasted. But is there a way to help deal with these types of issues? Selling your manga. It's just that simple. And I'm gonna teach you how and some tips and tricks to get the most bang for your buck and the best places to sell manga you no longer need. Or if you just need some quick cash. Um, uh, hi. Hello there. I seem to be boxed in and uh, suffocating here around manga. Now, what is this manga that you're seeing all around here? Well, this is about half, no joke, half of the manga that I have for sale at this moment in time that is bigger than a lot of people's collections. And let me tell you, it's not all enjoyable here to have all this manga for sale. It's a pain. I am not here to sell you my manga. I am here so you don't end up in a spot like me. So how do you get manga that you want to sell? Well, it's pretty simple. You either no longer want it and you want to sell it, or you don't really care and you want to sell it, or you do like the manga, but you need money and you want to sell it. It's about money. The manga you see around here and the hundreds that you don't see, and even though I'm sitting with my green screen down, I promise you these are all real. These are all real. So for me, a lot of these are things that I bought double of or accidentally bought and couldn't return or some are damaged and they didn't want me to send them back or a lot of them are things like like series like this which I just didn't enjoy and I didn't feel like collecting or having on my shelves because there's some things that I'm not even reading and I may never read or get to. I will try to but I may never get to but I don't feel like selling them because I still feel like collecting and there is a chance that I may read or get to them once the series is complete or if it gets better or something like that but you do not even need a reason to sell your manga if you just want money or you just want space or to get rid of them or anything that is good enough you do not want to end up with hundreds of manga that you're stuck with each one of these represent time and money so number one is bookstores like like half price books or book trading programs, which could be legitimate stores or legitimate programs to trade in manga for either money or for donations. Now donations are not getting you paid, but if you have manga that you've been sitting on for a long time and it may not be worth much, or you're just sick of it sitting around or you feel like donating to some program to get manga in the hands of someone else that is great so depending on where you live and what country you're in there's tons of different things from libraries to churches to bookstores to everything that you can trade things like this in depending on what you got so you have to look it up i know around me i can always rely on half price books to give me 25 cents or less maybe even for any book which is not ideal but for some people it might just be better than nothing to just drag in a big box of manga that you, that aren't worth much or you don't really want anymore and leave with 10 bucks number two utilizing selling websites whether that be selling on amazon selling on alibris if i'm saying that right selling on ebay selling on sites like that where it is regulated and you'll have to pay fees and, and things are more legit. And that's where you will have to pay taxes and fees and things like that, which can be a pain. But the main one that we know of is generally going to be eBay. And that is also a great place to find manga sales you get to see how much this has been selling for so if you're trying to find a price and you don't know what to do you can go to ebay and check sold listings and generally get an idea of how much your manga is worth 
it is a good thing to do. But I will tell you, eBay and PayPal and things like that are gonna nip at your profits. Number three, and this is the one that I use the most and 90 plus percent of the time, and it is the secondary market that comes from social sites. And what I mean by that is the big one that is our manga swap. Now you may have heard of this before, but this can be globally also, whether you're in a different country, yada yada. You get on there, you post your stuff, you post your prices, you can haggle with people, you can reach out to people, you can do trades, you can do whatever you want. Just make sure you're always using PayPal goods and services or something that can protect you because there's always scumbags out there no matter where you go or no matter what option you choose. And you have a lot of eyes on your manga so you can get a lot of sales. Also in this space are things like Instagram, though that one is a little more relying on followers and stuff like that but you can still sell things on there and also also Twitter I don't have a Twitter but I'm assuming you can sell things on Twitter also and then you get down to the other great chunk of places to sell manga which are like Facebook and here are some groups that I am in and these groups you can sell things globally locally so you don't even have to be in North America and they have certain groups for certain areas so you just need to check whether you're in the UK or you're in the United States or you're in Canada or something in Mexico you get to pick the place you want and then you put your stuff for sale unless you want to do it globally. This is also a great place to find good priced manga and to see what other people are wanting. And then in the marketplace, you can also search by your area or pinpoint different areas to see what manga is for sale, what is selling, what is not selling, and you can put your stuff up for sale locally if you're okay with meeting in person. But that's not all, the lists go on and on. I'm sure there's a ton I've missed. There's OfferUp, there's Craigslist, there's Mercari. There's tons of places to sell manga. Some are slow, some are quicker, and some are just not as good as others. I've had good experiences and not so good experiences with most of these places. Now when it comes to selling your manga and getting the best bang for the buck and to not waste your time, make sure you're telling prices that you want. Make sure you say OBO or best offer. Make sure you clean up your manga, get them nice and tidy and take a nice bright picture. And if they're yellowed or they're damaged or they have anything on them, make sure you show those Make sure you show the pictures of that and let the buyer know what kind of damage, if any, there are. It will save you a lot of time from having multiple people say, can I see more pictures? Can I see more pictures? Can I see more pictures? And then the pricing is up to you. You can check places like eBay and things like that to see what prices are good for your manga, or you get to set the price to whatever you want. If you wanna sell this for $100 million, you might not get any bids, but maybe if you're lucky, you will. Who knows? If you're meeting in person, make sure you stay safe, meet in a safe place and protect yourself. If you're using places like eBay, make sure you don't forget shipping. Shipping costs money. This book cost me $3.50 or $4 to ship. Two books cost me $3.50 or $4 to ship. Three books might cost me $4.50 or $5. So for one book it's more, but for three it's about the same. So things like that matter. And if you wanna save money on manga, when you sell all this manga and you wanna try that new awesome series, when you're shopping at Sci-Fi or an awesome new site, links down below, use the code THEMANGASLOTH for 10% more off your whole order. There is even a points system, so you're gonna accumulate and get more points for cheap manga that works with any currency to anywhere in the world just make sure you switch the currency to British pounds then apply the coupon at the checkout and then pay it will convert to whatever currency that you have and still get you the 10% off thank you for watching sell that manga I'll see you all next time